Ever wondered what steroids really do to your body? Do they actually work? And what about the risks? What happens when you mess with your testosterone levels artificially? Today, we're uncovering the truth about anabolic steroids. The benefits might be tempting, but the price you pay can be steep. A lot of people look for shortcuts, but is it really worth it? And what happens when the cycle ends? If you want to understand how these substances work, their effects, and the consequences they bring, stick around until the end. We're breaking it all down based on science. No exaggerations, no myths. And at the end, we've got an alternative for those who want results without putting their health on the line. Ready? Let's get into it. Do anabolic steroids actually work? That's a common question among beginners in bodybuilding and even experienced athletes. The answer is crystal clear. Yes, they are extremely effective when it comes to increasing strength, muscle size, and endurance. But what makes these substances so powerful? They're synthetic versions of testosterone, the key hormone responsible for muscle growth. Once inside the body, they boost protein synthesis and speed up muscle recovery, allowing for more intense training and fast results. A classic study compared four groups. One that didn't train and didn't use steroids, another that trained naturally, a third group that used steroids without training, and finally, a group that combined both. The results were shocking. People who took steroids without even touching a weight gained more muscle than those who trained naturally. That just goes to show how powerful these substances can be for muscle growth, even without external stimulus. But is this shortcut really worth it? Over the years, steroids have been modified to make them more anabolic and less androgenic, reducing side effects like hair loss and excessive body hair growth. However, even with these tweaks, long-term use can trigger serious side effects. The human body has a delicate hormonal balance, and any interference can lead to unexpected consequences. That's why it's crucial to understand that results come with risks that can't be ignored. So, did you already know about this study? What do you think about the impact of steroids on the body? Drop your thoughts in the comments. Testosterone is the most important hormone for muscle growth. But did you know there are multiple variations of it? In the world of anabolic steroids, testosterone comes in different forms, known as analogs. Even though they have very similar chemical structures, they don't all work the same way in the body. Some are more potent, others have fewer side effects and some are used for specific goals like bulking, cutting, or boosting strength. To understand how this works, imagine the androgen receptor as a lock. Testosterone and its analogs are different types of keys that can fit into this lock, triggering various responses. Some of these keys activate the receptors more intensely, leading to rapid muscle growth, while others have a more moderate effect. This explains why certain steroids are better for bulking, while others are commonly used during cutting and definition phases. The most mind-blowing part? Some of these substances can be up to 50 times more powerful than natural testosterone. That means muscle growth can be insanely fast and intense. But with that power comes risk. The stronger the steroid, the higher the chances of severe side effects like hormonal suppression, cardiovascular issues, and liver damage. What many people don't realize is that using stronger anabolic compounds can have long-term consequences on the body. Did you already know about these differences between types of testosterone? What's your take on using synthetic analogs for muscle growth? Drop your thoughts in the comments. Muscle growth is a highly complex biological process with protein synthesis playing a key role. When testosterone or its analogs enter the body, they bind to androgen receptors in muscle cells acting as a trigger for muscle development. This interaction sends signals to the cell nucleus, activating genes responsible for producing contractile proteins. With more protein available, muscles repair and grow faster after training, becoming bigger and stronger in less time. One of the most surprising aspects of anabolic steroid use is that muscle growth isn't solely dependent on training. Studies show that individuals taking high doses of testosterone can gain significant muscle mass even without working out. That's because steroids create an extremely anabolic environment where muscle building outpaces natural tissue breakdown. However, when these substances are combined with intense training and proper nutrition, the results become even more dramatic. Beyond enhanced protein synthesis, Another crucial factor in steroid-driven muscle growth is the increase in myonuclei. 
These cellular structures play a key role in muscle regeneration and growth, acting as command centers within muscle fibers. Normally, myonuclei multiply in response to mechanical stress like lifting weights, but with steroid use, this process happens spontaneously, even without external stimulus. This means the body becomes more efficient at building muscle and can maintain gains for longer, even after stopping the use of these substances. But this raises an important question. How sustainable are these gains? Can the body maintain this new muscle mass naturally, or does it start to shrink as soon as the synthetic hormones leave the system? Additionally, what are the side effects of this artificial interference in muscle growth? To understand the real impact of anabolic steroids on muscle growth, it's essential to look at concrete scientific data. A study conducted by researchers analyzed the effects of testosterone on individuals over a 10-week period. A total of 43 healthy men were recruited and divided into four distinct groups to evaluate how testosterone use and training influenced muscle growth. The results were impressive, clearly showing the power of this substance in physical development. The first group, called the control group, did not train and also did not use steroids. As expected, these participants did not experience any significant muscle gains throughout the study. The second group did not train but received 600 milligrams of testosterone per week. Their muscle growth was surprising. In just 10 weeks, they gained about 3.2 kilograms, 7 pounds, of muscle, even without any exercise stimulus. This data reinforces what we mentioned earlier about the anabolic effect of testosterone, which alone is capable of promoting hypertrophy. The third group, consisting of individuals who trained but did not use steroids, also saw muscle gains, but to a lesser extent. On average, they gained 1.8 kilograms for pounds of muscle over the 10 weeks, a result consistent with what is normally expected from effective training combined with a well-structured diet. On the other hand, the fourth group, which combined training with 600 milligrams of testosterone per week, had the best results of all. These individuals gained 5.9 kilograms, 13 pounds, of muscle in the same period, more than three times the muscle growth recorded by the group that trained without steroids. This study reinforces a reality well known in the sports and scientific fields. Testosterone significantly enhances muscle gains, even in individuals who do not train. However, do these gains come without costs? How does the body react to prolonged use of these substances? And what side effects might arise? These are fundamental questions that we will address in the next chapter. Anabolic steroids are widely known for their ability to transform an athlete's physique in record time. Whether for muscle gain, strength increase, or fat reduction, these substances offer significant advantages for those looking to maximize their performance. However, it's important to understand that these benefits come with risks, something we will explore in the upcoming chapters. For now, let's focus on the three main benefits of steroid use, accelerated muscle recovery, increased strength, and higher calorie burn. Accelerated muscle recovery is one of the most noticeable benefits for those who use steroids. During training, muscle fibers suffer micro tears that need to be repaired for muscle growth to occur. Naturally, this process takes time, ranging from a day or two to nearly a week, depending on the intensity of the exercise. However, when testosterone levels are artificially elevated, this regeneration happens much faster. This means steroid users can train more frequently and with greater volume without experiencing as much muscle soreness or prolonged fatigue. This effect not only improves performance in training, but also allows athletes to speed up their lean mass gains. Another major benefit of steroid use is the significant increase in strength. Contrary to what many believe, strength gains don't happen just because of increased muscle size. Testosterone and its derivatives directly impact the neuromuscular system, improving how efficiently the brain recruits muscle fibers during movement. This allows steroid users to generate more force per rep, making it possible to lift heavier weights and achieve far superior performance in the gym. Additionally, the structure of tendons and ligaments also strengthens, reducing the risk of injuries. Although excessive steroid use can have the opposite effect, as we will discuss later. The third benefit is higher calorie burn and fat loss. Testosterone plays a crucial role in regulating metabolism, 
helping to speed up fat burning. This happens because the hormone stimulates lipolysis, a process in which the body breaks down fat stores for energy. Additionally, the more muscle mass a person has, the higher their resting caloric expenditure, since muscle consumes more energy than fat. That's why steroid users often notice a leaner and more defined appearance, especially when following cutting protocols that combine anabolic steroids with strategic diets to reduce body fat percentage without losing muscle mass. But do these benefits outweigh the risks? This is where the discussion becomes more complex. While steroids can offer impressive advantages in performance and aesthetics, their use can trigger a range of serious side effects. Hormonal imbalances, liver damage, cardiovascular problems, and even psychological effects are some of the major concerns associated with long-term steroid use. In the next chapter, we'll dive into the risks and side effects of steroids and examine the potential consequences they can cause. But before that, we want to hear from you. Do you think the benefits are enough to justify the use of these substances? Anabolic steroids offer remarkable benefits, but their use also comes with a range of risks that can compromise health in both the short and long term. The first major issue is the suppression of natural testosterone production. The human body regulates this hormone through the pituitary gland and the testes, maintaining a proper hormonal balance. However, when synthetic testosterone is introduced, the body perceives that there is already enough circulating hormone and shuts down its natural production. Over time, this can lead to testicular atrophy, as the testes stop receiving the necessary stimulus to produce testosterone. Additionally, suppression can cause infertility, since sperm production also depends on the body's natural hormonal regulation. In some cases, even after stopping steroid use, hormonal recovery can be extremely slow, requiring specific therapies that don't always guarantee the endocrine system will return to normal function. Another serious risk is related to the cardiovascular system. Steroid use can increase blood pressure, putting extra strain on the heart and contributing to the development of cardiac hypertrophy. This excessive growth of heart muscle can reduce the heart's efficiency, increasing the risk of heart failure. Furthermore, steroids directly impact cholesterol levels, raising LDL, bad cholesterol, while lowering HDL, good cholesterol, which is crucial for cardiovascular health. This imbalance promotes fatty plaque buildup in the arteries, significantly increasing the risk of heart attacks and strokes. Many steroid users don't notice these effects because cardiovascular damage often develops silently over the years, only becoming apparent when it's too late. The liver also takes a major hit, especially when oral steroids are used. These compounds must be processed by the liver, overloading the organ and increasing liver enzyme levels, which indicate damage. Prolonged use can lead to fatty liver disease, severe inflammation, and, in extreme cases, liver failure. Some oral steroids are so toxic that they can cause liver tumors, a problem that may go unnoticed until it reaches a critical stage. Even with the use of liver protectants, the impact on the liver remains a constant concern for those who engage in long cycles or excessive steroid use. Visible side effects are also a major concern for steroid users. The conversion of testosterone into DHT, dihydrotestosterone, a hormone derivative, can accelerate hair loss in individuals who are genetically predisposed, leading to irreversible baldness. Additionally, increased skin oil production can trigger severe acne which in some cases leaves permanent scars. Another common side effect is gynecomastia, which occurs when excess testosterone converts into estrogen, causing breast tissue growth in men. This condition can be difficult to reverse and often requires surgical removal of the excess tissue. Beyond the physical effects, the psychological impact of steroid use is profound. During a cycle, elevated testosterone levels can create a sense of extreme confidence increased energy, and even aggression. However, when the cycle ends and hormone levels crash, the effects can be devastating. Many users report severe fatigue, lack of motivation, loss of strength, and intense depressive symptoms. The body's natural testosterone production can take months or even years to recover, making this period extremely difficult. As a result, many users fall into continuous cycles to avoid the hormonal crash creating a psychological dependence that can be as strong as addiction to other substances. 
This makes it incredibly difficult for some users to quit steroids, even after experiencing severe side effects. Now that we've covered the risks involved in using these substances, the question arises, are there alternatives for those seeking significant results without compromising their health? Is it possible to achieve an impressive physique without relying on anabolic steroids? In the next chapter, we'll explore natural alternatives to steroids and examine how strategic training, proper nutrition, and supplementation can help build muscle without the dangers associated with synthetic substances. Maintaining healthy testosterone levels naturally is the best way to ensure consistent muscle growth without putting your health at risk. While anabolic steroids can lead to rapid and dramatic gains, the associated risks make them a dangerous choice for many. Fortunately, there are natural and effective ways to boost testosterone production and maximize physical performance without resorting to synthetic substances. Small adjustments to daily habits can make a huge difference in hormone levels, allowing the body to perform at its peak without the destructive side effects of steroids. The first key factor in optimizing testosterone is getting quality sleep. During deep sleep, the body releases the majority of its testosterone and growth hormone, both essential for muscle development and recovery. Studies show that sleeping less than six hours per night can drastically reduce testosterone production, negatively impacting training results and increasing stress levels. Establishing a consistent sleep routine, avoiding blue light exposure before bed, and ensuring at least seven to eight hours of rest per night can make a huge difference in hormonal balance. A balanced diet also plays a crucial role. Certain nutrients are essential for testosterone production, such as zinc, magnesium, and healthy fats, including high-quality protein sources like lean meats, eggs, and fish, along with complex carbohydrates and good fats found in olive oil, avocado, and nuts, helps provide the body with the necessary building blocks for hormone production. Additionally, it's important to avoid extremely restrictive diets, which can increase cortisol levels, a stress hormone that lowers testosterone. Another key factor in naturally optimizing testosterone is intense and consistent training. High-intensity exercises, such as weightlifting and compound movements, are the most effective for boosting testosterone production. Squats, deadlifts, and bench presses activate a large number of muscle fibers and stimulate testosterone release. Training should be challenging but balanced, avoiding excessive volume, which can have the opposite effect by raising cortisol levels. Additionally, stress reduction is often overlooked but plays a vital role. Chronic stress triggers the release of cortisol, and excessive cortisol can suppress testosterone production and make muscle gains more difficult. Techniques such as meditation, deep breathing, and leisure activities can help keep hormone levels balanced. Managing stress not only improves testosterone levels, but also enhances overall quality of life. Finally, sun exposure is a simple and effective strategy for maintaining high testosterone levels. Sunlight is the primary source of vitamin D, an essential nutrient for hormone production. People with vitamin D deficiency often have low testosterone levels, making 15 to 30 minutes of daily sun exposure an important habit. When adequate sun exposure isn't possible, supplementation can be a viable alternative. Maintaining a lifestyle that naturally supports testosterone production is the best way to build a strong and healthy physique without the risks of steroids. At the end of the day, the choice is yours, but the most important thing is being well-informed before making any decision. Now, I want to hear from you. Do you think it's worth taking the risk? Have you ever met someone who used steroids? Drop your thoughts in the comments. If this video helped you in any way, don't forget to leave a like. It really helps the channel grow. And if you haven't subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you don't miss the next videos. And if you want to learn more about how to naturally boost testosterone and reach your goals without compromising your health, check out the video in the card and description. See you there!